In this video, I'll be explaining to you what is Redis and why should we use Redis in the first place. Well, Redis is a in-memory database that offers ridiculous amount of speed in writing and reading. But hold on. I know what you must be asking yourself. You know databases already. You've used Microsoft SQL. You used MySQL. You've used the Oracles. But how does Redis differ from any of these rela relational databases? Well, Redis is a non-relational database. That means Redis goes into the basket of the MongoDBs, Redis, Memcache, all these non-relational databases offer some of the same abilities in some different form or shape. So Redis offers five data structures that you can manipulate whichever way you want for your application, which are strings, hashes, lists, sets, and sorted sets. How does this differ from MySQL? Well, MySQL is a relational database that you have rows and columns and tables, and those tables have relations with other tables, and so on and so forth. But with Redis, you no longer have that. So you're no longer constrained to thinking about your problem in that form. So with MySQL, you're, you're used to doing selects, inserts, updates, delete, functions, stored, stored procedures, all these type of things. But with Redis, you're more focused into the actual data structure to manipulate your data for your application. So there you have it. I just covered Redis and what exactly Redis is. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Follow me on Twitter and get ready for part two.